solve large intractable problems. It's a new venture altogether. Your brain is a wild horse there. Because remember, writing is not a team sport. You are not selling horse carriages when there are cars. I want to be known only as a trusted advisor. More like a tourist. Play to Potential Podcast. In life, it's uh, very often about building trust with a set of people, whether it's professional relationships, personal relationships. And there, uh, at least, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, David, I, I feel that you start building trust only when you sort of have some sense of the other person's intent, which often you uh, you sort of start getting a sense of based on continued behavior uh, from a person. Uh, how do you, uh, you know, back to your point about observing people's behavior and resisting the urge to um, form stories versus the need to um, start curating the world, if I may, so that we know who we can trust, who we don't trust. Do, do you see a tension there somewhere? Not as much. Uh, first of all, I think it helps to, at least I find personally, I take the orientation, I'll trust you until you prove otherwise. Hmm rather than you have to prove your trust because the latter gets me into a suspicious mode, which doesn't help to build openness in our interaction. So I'm going to start with that orientation. Doesn't mean that I'm going to trust you with everything hmm. and you my wallet or my bank account. Um, but I'm going to be willing to be more open and be vulnerable. That's the first thing I would do. The more that I disclose, the more you're likely to trust me and you'll disclose. So I may not need to do much inquiry because you may be saying that I'm signaling I want to be open and you're going to feel, you're going to hopefully going to reciprocate. But I think the other thing is if there are some things which start to become problematic, our first tendency is to make up that story. Mm -hmm. Deepak is clearly the sort of person. Can I get into curiosity? Can I say, Deepak, you said something that uh, puzzled me and I got to say bothered me a little bit. Well, hopefully trust in you, by you is going up because I'm being honest. Hmm. And you know that I'm going to be telling you when I'm a little bothered. And I'm going to say, well, what's going on? And you're going to tell me. And I'm going to say, okay, that's helpful. Because I was worried it might be something else, which I would have some trouble with. And you see, I'm continuing to disclose. I'm disclosing that I was bothered, I was unhappy. I also expressed an interest in you. I wanted to know you. I didn't try and play prosecuting attorney. I said, hey, you know, I'd like to know what you're doing. And I think the more you do that, if, if you raise the issues that could threaten trust and surface them, that actually will build trust. 